All right, here with Reed Connor, automatic qualifier in the 3,000 meters after his run today. Reed, I thought the plan initially was to go to Notre Dame for a last chance meet, but you decided to, to run here on the home track. What was what was the decision there? Yeah, that was the plan uh, until about uh, Wednesday this week. Nick calls me and says, hey, you want to go to Notre Dame or we have a last chance meet here at home? And I said, Nick, I got some schoolwork. I want to sleep in my own bed and I can do it at home. So let me stay here. And he said, all right, Nick, if you think you can do it, I trust you. And well, I did it. So. How much did it help to have your teammates here, too? You had the guys really help you through the first 2K. That was a big deal. Uh, I had the Rabbits, you know, they were helping me. I, and it wasn't just the people on the track, it was the people on the sidelines, too. They all got me through it, and everyone did a great job because the results speak for itself. Fastest time uh, in the country this year in the 3,000 on a flat 200-meter track. How does that feel? That's, that's something not a lot of people do, attempting a 3K on a 200-meter track like this. Yeah, lots of people are getting afraid to run on the flat tracks for fast times, but uh, I just feel like 3,000 meters is 3,000 meters, and uh, you know some people say that you know a tall guy can't do it. I'm about six one, but it doesn't really matter. I think at the end of the day, if you can run it, uh, it doesn't matter what kind of track you're on. And we talked about the help you had through the first 2K, but you had to do it all alone the last thousand meters or so. How, how tough was it to be running against the clock like that by yourself? It's always tough running against the clock. Uh, normally the clock wins. You know, it doesn't have, it doesn't feel pain. But uh, I felt like I had a fighting chance today and uh, went out there and, yeah, I beat it. So. Badgers have a nice contingent in the distance events going to College Station now. How does it feel to be qualified for the NCAA meet? Uh, it's great. Uh, we have a lot of guys going. Mo, Mav, we got you know, Hep Guy, and I wanted to be there with them. We're going to Texas. That's where I'm from. I had to go back and uh, go in front of the home crowd, so to speak. Yep. All right. Congratulations. Thank you very much.